your health. They're touted as refreshing drinks full of vitamins and minerals. But are vitamin drinks really good for you? Registered dietitian Tammy Famusa is here with her take on these highly marketed products. And these are just some of many. Sports drinks do it. You know, there's juices. This, this is an $18 billion business, so there's a ton out there. There's so many now. Not I mean, This is a popular one. I could have got some more, but there's just a billion of them. So what is your take on this in general terms? Are these good for you? I would say if you're drinking one or two of these a day, no. Because our body, we're getting enough nutrients from the foods we eat. If you think, you know, you're really eating bad, or, then I would suggest taking a multivitamin or talking to your physician about a multivitamin. But if you're taking a multivitamin plus eating a somewhat healthy Food diet and yeah. drinking a lot of these, you could be overdoing it. And, and do we know what effects we could be, you know, so, experiencing? Right, and so a lot of the study pointed out that, you know, especially some of these that say antioxidants, yeah. right? So our body is basically antioxidants fight free radicals. Free radicals can cause damage in your DNA yep. and cause, cause other damage. But we need free radicals as well to help. Because they're cancer fighting. Well, not only cancer fighting, but infection. They're fighting okay. infection too. So if you're throwing, if you're overloading the system with a lot of these antioxidants, think, I mean, your system... It finds a way to regulate itself, but if you're you pushing too much it. buttons, it's going to overregulate. And this says antioxidant vitamin A, so it's See? trying to sell you on making sure you get antioxidants. And some of these, like this has 150% vitamin C, 150% vitamin exactly. C. Exactly. Who needs that? We don't need that. I mean, look at your daily levels for your age yep. and see what are your recommended needs. Another point you brought out, vitamin A. So there's different types of vitamins. Your water-soluble vitamins and your fat-soluble vitamins. Your fat-soluble vitamins are going to be your A, D, E, and K, right? Okay. The water-soluble are going to be washed out in your urine. So yeah, vitamin C, something like that, 120 20%. Luckily, a lot of it will just go out in the urine, right? But the ones, the, the fat soluble, they're not going to go out in the urine. So if you overload and increase, something's going to happen in your yeah. body as far as toxic for your liver because your liver's going to process that. What foods are fortified so that people can be assured that they are eating food that actually has vitamins and minerals in them? What are the foods we've been saying? Vegetables, yeah. fruits, vegetables. And, and you know bread is fortified, right? Milk's been fortified with vitamin D. So some, some of those basics. basic stuff. Staples. It's going to be the staples are fortified. Yeah. The other stuff, you're just going to overpower your system and you're probably not going to feel well. And you'll wonder, you'll think you're getting all these vitamins and you're doing good for your body. But, and I think these are good. I, I have one occasionally, but I, I don't. I mean, you'd I, say this is better than a Mountain Dew. Oh my gosh, yes. Right. But if you look at the sugar, you're still talking about four teaspoons of sugar in the ones that yeah. have sugar. Yeah. So there's like all these different grams angles. Right. In this, in this right. bottle. So, so I just want to make sure people are clear. If they're eating staples, they're getting some vitamins and minerals. If they feel like they're not getting enough, a supplement is better than one of these. I would say talk to your physician. I can't tell, you know, everybody's okay. different, right? But I would say probably a vitamin supplement would be better yeah. than, than overlaying this. But definitely you don't want to be taking a vitamin supplement plus like one or two of these a day, right? right? Because then you're really going to overload the system. So don't be fooled by 150% and, no, no. and, oh, and think, oh, I'm doing, I'm doing so, so much, much better, better for my body. No, because we, we haven't regulated yeah. all that. We, we, our diet usually does pretty well. Tammy, thanks so much. We All appreciate right. it. Thanks for having me. We'll be back right after this.